I cannot believe I got all these for 65 cents each. This is crazy. Hi everyone, it's Lindy. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing an unboxing of some shelf pull cosmetics from Via Trading. So this box, I am so excited to show you guys because the unit price on these is so good, it can't be real, but it is real. It's on their site. So now these are shelf pull cosmetics. They are not customer returns, which means that all items in this box should be brand new quality because shelf pulls means that the store themselves pulled them from the shelves and liquidated them because maybe they were clearance items that didn't sell or maybe they're discontinued or maybe the package had a flaw. Perhaps the store just needed to make space on their shelves for new merchandise coming in. Either way, that means that we get a good deal and we can sell it ourselves and we don't have to worry about open products or used products because nothing is returned it's all brand new so this box came from via trading it is a 300 unit box for only 195 dollars that is a unit cost of only 65 cents an item 65 cents what the what? This is by far the cheapest I've ever been able to purchase liquidated cosmetics. And that's why I am so excited to dig into this box and see what we've got. You know, prior to this, the cheapest I was able to get cosmetics was close to a dollar per item, but those were all customer returns. There was no telling how much of it was actually going to be sellable. But since these are all shelf pulls, every single one of these should be able to be listed and sold online. And they're only 65 cents a piece. Also, just a friendly reminder that my coupon code with Via Trading is still active. It's just my name, and there's also a link down in the video description. It doesn't get me anything but kudos, but it gets you guys $50 off your purchase of $250 or more your first time shopping with Via Trading. So that code and that link are down there in the video description. If you have been interested in buying from Via Trading and you've just been waiting to take the plunge, you can use my coupon code and save some money when you try them out. I am not wasting any more time. There's 300 items in this box. I'm gonna open it up and get to looking. All right, all right, let's see, what do we have here? So one of the things that Via Trading never disappoints with for me is their ability to package things really well. So everything in here, it was so snugly packaged already, just looking, I see nothing crushed, I see nothing broken, and that's because it was shipped and packed very, very well. Already, I see some duplicates and I love duplicates because it makes the listing process go so much faster, especially when there's 300 items. So right off the bat, I'm just gonna pull these. Ah, uh, these are the Maybelline Age Instant Age Rerun. Re <laughs> Let's try that in an instant replay. <laughs> Maybelline Instant Age Rewind. Re I did it again. <laughs> I'm so excited I can't even speak. Uh, <laughs> eraser Makeup Treatment. Uh, let's see, this one's tan, creamy beige, honey, tan. Okay, so a couple of tan and a couple of honeys. So... We've got three different colors, five different tubes. I know these sell for about $10 or so, so that's a really good one. And also, just glancing right on the top, nothing is used, everything is brand new and sealed. Okay, so we've got a couple of these Maybelline Volume Expert Mascaras. Uh, they are both brownish black. A L'Oreal Infallible Smoke, Smoke Kiss Me, Smoke, I don't, I don't know, a Powder Eyeliner Pen. Okay, we've got a few of these. They're all, oh, wait, these are the same. 
Um, so yeah, definitely some do uh, some definitely some duplicates. The this is Coral, the Master Highlight Face Studio, Coral and Deep Bronze. So stuff like this when it comes to hello hello. When it comes to these, what I'll end up doing is I'll end up sorting everything and then I'll group all of the identical items together and just depending on the list price, I might sell them as a lot or I might sell them individually, just depending. Um, if something is selling for, you know, $7 and under, I'll try to group them together or any more than that, I'll do singles. That's just how I'm approaching this entire situation. All right, so got some highlights so there's a little just a little bit of breakage in there just a little bit just a wee bit but it's still completely sealed so so far everything is completely true to the fact that it's just that it's just shelf pulls it's not used all of these oh look at all the highlight palettes oh oh don't don't drop them oh uh, okay we got some breakage this one's broken Womp, womp, womp. That one's broken. Uh, just a casualty. It's a casualty. It's not broken because it's used. It's just broken because of whatever reason it might be broken. There's a whole bunch of these highlight palettes. I really like that. Stuff like highlighter does really, really well. All right, let's pull some, let's pull some lips aside here. It's a Maybelline. I've sold these before. Uh, they're the Maybelline New York... I forget what they're called. I forget what they're called, forgive me. But we've got a few different shades. And of course, these always do better for me. Lipsticks especially do better in lots. So what I'll do is I'll just put all of the identical shades together and sell them in lots. Whole bunch there. All right, and then here's some Maybelline Fit Me Pressed Powder. Natural Buff, Porcelain soft honey okay so we've got a lot of them but a lot of different shades but then there's also some duplicates so a lot of duplicates and list the singles grab them all out of here some more lipsticks oh there's another highlighter yes i love 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 seeing duplicates because that makes the listing process go so much faster and then can tell by this sticker here, that's Walmart. So these came from Walmart. So we've got My Tuxedo and Lasting Lilac um, eye, uh, eyeshadow. Here's a Maybelline Expert Tools blush brush. Some baby lips. Dr. Rescue Medicated Lip Balm. Baby Lips Crystal. Here's some Maybelline Fit Me Shine Free Foundation Sticks. Here's a Baby Lips. I've never seen Baby Lips like this. I don't want to open it. Uh, moisturizing Lip Gloss. Some more Age Rewind. There's another one. Oh, I love seeing so many of those. Uh, another Foundation Stick. Some more of the Maybelline Lips. There's another one. Ooh, those look like the same shade, so I'd lock those together. Here's a Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream. Uh, it's 100 Light Sheer Tint. Maybelline Volume Express The Rocket Mascara. Another Volume Express Chaotic Lash. Here's a Dream Bouncy Maybelline Blush. More lip, another Dream Bouncy. This one is shade 70, this one is shade 50. Plum Wine and Hot Tamale. Here's another lip and another The Rocket. Ooh, there's some more Baby Lips Moisturizing Lip Gloss. This one is tinted. It's another Blush. Oh, here's a bronze BB 8-in-1 Beauty Balm. Oh, this one's a little bit messy. This one's a little bit messy, but that's okay. It's another of the 8-in-1 Beauty Balms. These are really well packaged. Look at that. Look at that. Good job, Via Trading. That was done well. Okay, 
So here is a bunch of fingernail polishes. So fingernail polishes, I like to do one of two ways. Uh, the best thing I like to do with fingernail polishes is lot them up and sell them locally. What I'll do is I'll just put on Facebook Marketplace, I'll just say, fingernail polish, take all for X amount of dollars, and that's kind of how I'll handle it. Or I will ship them as a lot on something like Mercari, uh, because Mercari you can do, can you even see me? Mercari, you can do really heavy packages at FedEx for a discounted price for the shipping label. So I would lot these up and sell them on Mercari, or I would sell them local. So that's how I plan to handle all nail polish. But I'm probably not going to open it up and show every single one. But there's some Sally Hansen hard nails in there. There's some, ooh, there's some really pretty like glitter mermaid style looking ones. Looks like mostly Sally Hansen. Um, but it looks like a lot of different ones. There's not a lot of duplicates, which is nice when you're selling lots. Because when you're selling lots, you can tell someone that there's not a whole lot of duplicates. Because when someone buys a lot they are wanting a whole bunch of different stuff, not just all the exact same stuff. All right, and here's another bag of fingernail polish. Again, more extreme wear Sally Henson, um, some Miracle Gel. So Miracle Gel, I'd probably separate and do Miracle Gel separate from the regular fingernail polish. And here's another little small bag, all the same kind of fingernail polishes, but these are all different shades it looks like than the other one over here. Here's a couple of, there's two in this bag. Let's open it up, shall we? All right, so these are sealed together, so that's perfect for selling online. Just needs to be shook up, shake it up. Uh, Miracle Gel, it looks like it's got the pink, Cadillacer <laughs> Miracle Gel, and then just top coat. Uh, so two sets that'll go on online nicely. Oh, nice! I love selling this kind of stuff. It's the airbrush legs. There's one that's tan and one that's fairest. I actually have one of these listed already, so I just need to replenish stock, and then I could do a sell similar listing to create one for that. Another baby lips. Here's a Maybelline Define a Line eyeliner. Here's another lip, another bouncy blush, another lip. Okay, so this one is Maybelline polish. Uh, these are the Maybelline Color Show. So because, oh, and these are all Maybelline Color Show too. Awesome, okay. So I would do two different lots and I would do the Maybelline and then I would do the Sally Henson separate. Come back up and talk to me because I'm done going through the box. That's all of it. Okay, so my plan of action with the fingernail polish. So what I would do first is I would go through the independent brands, like these are all the Maybelline color, color, what color show? Uh, so what I would do is I would go through those and I would lot up the colors and I would use that to kind of determine how many lots I want to do. So I don't know if I'd want to do like all of these one lot or if I would want to do three smaller lots if I've got like three of a whole bunch of different colors. Maybe I can spread them out. You know what I mean? That way, because like in here, if I were to sell all of these, what if there's eight of the same color? Someone might not want eight of the same color. So what I can do is depending on how many of a certain color I have can determine how many separate lots I do. And I could just say Maybelline nail polish lot one, Maybelline nail polish lot two, lot three, and so on. And maybe each lot will have 10 fingernail polishes in it, depending. Same thing with the Sally Hansen or the Miracle Gel. Uh, same kind of idea. I would just lot them up in groups so that the lot didn't have a lot of duplicates of the exact same color. Maybe do some smaller lots with spreading the colors 
throughout so that someone didn't get a whole bunch of the exact same color. Um, but I've never had this much nail polish all at once before. So it's going to be really fun and interesting for me to like group the colors together and figure out, okay, these are the ones I'm going to put on Mercari. These are the ones I might put on eBay. These are the ones that I'm just going to sell local. So it's going to be really interesting to do that. And something that I might go ahead and do is I might go ahead and post them local first. And if I don't get any bites on my local post, then at that time I might go ahead and put them online just because sometimes you can move things on your local sales site like your local Facebook page or the local Facebook marketplace sometimes you can sell those so much faster it's not even worth the hassle to create a listing and wait for them to sell online if I could just post something like this on Facebook marketplace and say how many are in here let's say there's 25 in here I could just tell someone, hey, bag of fingernail polish for 40 bucks. If someone will buy it in the same day, that is the definition of a quick flip. And when you get items in lots like this, it's really exciting to think about all of the different ways you can go about selling it. You know, do you want to sell giant lots of fingernail polishes? Do you just want to sell sets of similar colors? Do you want to sell four different kinds of face highlighter all in one lot or do you want to sell them individually? You know, and if I were to get, I'm probably going to end up buying a couple more boxes of these because if I get more of the same similar kinds of items, that's just more options for me to create lots, you know, maybe bigger lots of highlighter palettes or maybe more lots of the fingernail polish. So when you have a wide variety like that and you can get it at such a good price, it's a really good opportunity for you to work with doing different kinds of lots and experimenting with different things. You know, maybe customized lots would sell better than singles or maybe singles will do better than some of these lots. You really don't know until you actually put forth the effort and give it a try. So I have 300 items here. But I kind of want more. Does that happen to you a lot? Put it down in the comments below. <laughs> Does it happen where you're like, oh, I have all of this, but I want more. I want more. Bum, ba, da, ba, ba, ba. I want more. Bum, ba, da, ba, ba, ba. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video and videos like it, please give it a thumbs up so that I know. Don't forget to check the video description. I will put the coupon code down there if you want to go try a box from Via Training. Uh, you just use my code and use that link down below and it will get you there and it'll get you a really nice $50 discount. And please do put down in the comments below if you have any questions, if you have any suggestions of how I should sell these cosmetics, put that down there in the comments below as well. And do please remember to subscribe if you're interested in seeing more content. And I'll see you guys with my next video. Bye-bye.